The digital landscape is evolving, traditional security models are no longer enough, we used to rely heavily on perimeters like firewalls, but today, that's like locking the front door and leaving all the windows open. The rise of remote work, cloud computing and mobile devices has shattered the perimeter. We need a new approach, zero trust. Zero trust is built on a simple principle, never trust, always verify. This applies not just to users but also to their devices. In the past, we focused on verifying user identities. But a compromised device can bypass even the strongest user authentication. Think of it this way, if someone steals your phone, they can access your accounts even without your password. This is where device trust comes in. It's not enough to know who is accessing your network. You also need to know if their device is secure. Device trust focuses on verifying the integrity and security posture of every device attempting to connect to your resources. This shift in focus is crucial for building a robust and resilient security framework. Why is device verification so important in a zero trust world? The answer is simple. Devices are now the keys to the kingdom. They hold sensitive data, connect to corporate networks, and access cloud applications. A compromised device can provide attackers with a backdoor into your entire system. Imagine an employee unknowingly using a malware-infected laptop. Even with strong credentials, the malware could capture keystrokes, steal data, and spread laterally across the network. Or consider a scenario where a stolen phone grants unauthorized access to corporate emails and sensitive files. These examples highlight the critical need to verify the security of devices before granting them access. Device verification goes beyond just checking for passwords or PINs. It involves a comprehensive assessment of the device's security posture. This includes verifying its identity, ensuring it meets compliance standards, and continuously monitoring its behavior for any signs of compromise. By implementing robust device verification measures, organizations can significantly reduce their attack surface and mitigate the risk of breaches. Establishing device trust is not a one-time event, it's an ongoing process. It involves three key steps, device identity, compliance enforcement, and continuous monitoring. First, we need to establish a device's identity. This involves assigning a unique identifier to each device attempting to connect to the network. Think of it like a digital fingerprint. This allows organizations to track devices, monitor their activity, and enforce policies. Next, compliance policies come into play. These policies define the minimum security requirements that a device must meet to access network resources. This might include having up-to-date antivirus software, a strong password policy, or specific operating system versions. Finally, continuous monitoring is essential. Device behavior can change over time, new threats emerge and vulnerabilities are discovered. Continuous monitoring allows organizations to detect suspicious activity, identify compromised devices and respond quickly to mitigate potential threats. EDR the watchdog for your devices. Endpoint detection and response or EDR plays a crucial role in device trust and overall endpoint security. Think of EDR as a sophisticated security camera and alarm system for your devices. It constantly monitors endpoint activity, detects suspicious behavior, and provides the tools to respond effectively to threats. EDR goes beyond traditional antivirus solutions, it doesn't just rely on known virus signatures, it uses behavioral analysis to identify and block even unknown threats. When suspicious activity is detected, EDR can automatically isolate the affected device, preventing the spread of malware and limiting potential damage. Furthermore, EDR provides valuable forensic information that helps understand the attack chain, identify vulnerabilities, and improve security posture. This information is crucial for preventing future attacks and strengthening overall security. Mobile Device Management – Securing the On-The-Go Workforce The rise of mobile devices has brought about unprecedented flexibility and productivity, but it has also introduced new security challenges. Mobile devices are often used to access sensitive corporate data, making them prime targets for attackers. That's where Mobile Device Management or MDM comes in. MDM solutions provide a centralized platform to manage and secure mobile devices connecting to your network. They allow organizations to enforce security policies, such as requiring strong passwords, encrypting data, and remotely wiping lost or stolen devices. This ensures that corporate data remains protected, even when accessed from personal devices. Moreover, MDM solutions can help manage the lifecycle of mobile devices, from enrollment to retirement. They can automate software updates, configure device settings, and ensure that devices meet compliance requirements. By implementing MDM, organizations can embrace mobile technology without compromising security. Maintaining Device Health Proactive Checks for Robust Security Device health checks are like regular medical checkups for your devices. 
Just as you wouldn't skip a doctor's appointment, neglecting device health can have serious consequences. These checks proactively identify vulnerabilities, misconfigurations, and other security risks that could compromise device trust. Device health checks go beyond basic security scans. They involve a comprehensive assessment of the device's software, configuration, and security settings. This includes checking for outdated software, weak passwords, and insecure network configurations. By identifying and remediating these issues promptly, organizations can maintain a high level of device trust and reduce their attack surface. Moreover, device health checks can be integrated into the network access process. Devices that fail to meet the defined health criteria can be automatically denied access or quarantined until the issues are resolved. This proactive approach ensures that only trusted and secure devices can connect to the network, bolstering overall security posture.